you see now easy it is to clean up your plug without involving the services of a technician hey guys welcome to benko institute of technical studies on today's class, we'll be looking at a small portable generator, TG950. It's a Chinese generator, and in this part of the world, it's popularly called, I better pass my neighbor. Anyways, on this class, we'll be looking at how to clean up a spark plug. How to clean up a spark plug. If you look at the generator carefully, you'll discover it's quite an old generator that has been used for a long time, for years now, uh, the client said. All right, this generator is working. Not that it's not working, it's working. But for the purpose of this class, I will be using this particular generator. I will lose up the plug right now. This is the plug. The plug is that part close to the starter. This is the starter. The starter, when you move a little, you get to the plug. Losing the plug, we use the plug spanner. It's called a plug spanner. Losing the plug, you rotate to the left, anti-clockwise. Okay, it's quite easy. Now, this is the plug we have. After losing, this is the plug. So what do we do when we have a plug like this? What do we do when we have a plug like this? Good. The best thing to do at this point is to, let's say you have a generator at home and you need to wash your plug. Perhaps it's time for servicing and you need to wash your plug. There is no technician around. What do you do? At that point, you get a flat screwdriver. Originally, what we usually use for something like this is what we call an iron brush. We just have to brush it, brush the, these two uh, electrodes the central electrode and this other electrode, we just have to brush them carefully with that um, iron brush. But in the absence of that, as someone who is home, who is not a technician, what do you do? You get foil. Use a flat screwdriver to quickly take off the carbon dirt. When your generator works over time, we have carbon dirt at the uh, electrode. In the absence of iron brush or a flat screwdriver, you can simply use any tiny object that you are setting will take off this carbon dirt. You wash carefully. There's already a big difference between um, the first pictures of this uh, plug and now okay good we we'll successfully wash just to make everything neat let's just wash the whole of the plug good you successfully wash the plug with foil and please do not use uh, any other liquid substance aside for otherwise uh, you may not get the required results from this um, little practical class all right having washed we'll notice that there is a gap between this central electrode and this other electrode and please make sure that gap is constant make sure the gap is constant because when the gap is not constant and Perhaps these two touches each other, your generator cannot start on any ground. No matter how hard you pull, no matter how hard you try, your generator cannot start. Now, after washing the plug, we insert back to the top cylinder. You screw back, this time, to the right. Make sure it's locked properly. And then you 
start. All right, that is it. You see now easy it is to clean up your plug without involving the services of a technician. If you've enjoyed this video, please do well to subscribe, turn on notification, send the links to friends and family so they can at least learn from this channel. And please drop your comment in the comment section so we can interact. To meet in our next class, it's goodbye from our end.